Hi folks, it's Ron, and welcome back to another industry tip. I get asked this one a lot in the courses I give. It is about working with 110 style connections and inserting the pairs properly into the blocks before termination. And the question is, where does the white of the pair land on the block? Some connections you run across, especially in residential, will not be clearly marked as to how to insert the pairs into the blocks. Here are a couple examples where the blocks are not clearly labeled. The block on the right is a telephone splicing block and essentially splices all 10 of these 110 style connections together. The block on the left here is a phone data block and can be used for cross-connecting services to an outlet. It is pre-wired in the 568A wiring scheme, but neither block clearly indicates how to insert the pairs into the blocks. Now, anytime you see a connection like this and you want to add another cable to the block, the trick is in knowing which side of the termination post the wide of the pair will land. To answer that is to pick a post on a connection to terminate. Then look to see which side of the connection the blue pair is positioned. The white of the pair we're working with will always face the blue pair. So as I insert the green pair over the green post, I know the white of that pair will be facing the blue post. And you can see on these connections that have already been terminated, the sequence goes white blue blue, white orange orange, white green green, and then white brown brown. And that is one of the biggest wiring errors I see when teaching people on how to work with these connections. I hope that helped, and thanks for watching. I'm Ron, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care out there, and good luck with your wire terminations.